Hi, welcome to this FX Algo Trader demonstration of the new Excel Control Suite for MetaTrader. Um, this is just an introductory video to the system. Uh, it's been developed uh, in Excel. Uh, it um, uses extensive VBA um, code uh, to interface and talk to underlying MetaTrader control files, um, which are actually comma separated variable files containing control data. Um, what this allows you to do is to control underlying FX Algo Trader indicators and expert advisors. Um, first of all, I'm just going to this, this video is just going to talk about the main interface and how the actual program is set up. So, first of all, um, we've we've developed the actual program as an Excel add-in. So, if I go to add-ins in Excel, you can see the add-ins come up here, and if I go to manage them you can see that the actual uh, Excel Control Suite version 2 tick box is, box is selected so let's just OK that. If we minimize Excel now uh, and we go into MetaTrader if we hit Control F the standard Excel Control Suite interface is displayed on the chart. Um, we can move this around, put this wherever we want. Um, the first thing to mention is when you first um, start the system you have to go to a setup screen um, and what that does is it allows um, the trader to specify where the MetaTrader file system uh, is installed on the actual local machine so in this case we've got, if we want to change this we just go to the experts folder and we can simply select any file within the experts directory and we select ODL MetaTrader. This is just my particular instance installed on my hard drive and I can simply select any MQ4 file and the system will automatically uh, set the various paths for the experts directory, the files path and also the libraries path which is important. And So that's essentially the initial setup of the Excel control suite. The only thing we need to do within MetaTrader to make the system work is to load um, an expert advisor which is specific for the Excel control suite called Handler version 2 and we just put that on the chart and we're good to go.